I'm at Horizon Divers in Key Largo, where I've come with several of the divers from our staff to try the Hollis Explorer Sport Rebreather. Now, most rebreathers are designed for technical diving, but the Explorer is different. It's designed specifically for recreational diving. So what is a recreational rebreather? Like all rebreathers, the Explorer lets you breathe recirculated gases so that you increase your bottom time and lengthen your dive time. The thing that's different about the Explorer is that it has very sophisticated electronics to monitor all of the vital functions while you're diving so that you know instantly if there's a problem with any of them. It alerts you with a light right in front of your face where you can see it, allows you to switch to a safe bailout gas. With the Explorer, you need to perform a very thorough pre-dive checklist, but with this unit, it actually shows you on the computer handset step by step and walks you through everything you need to do. The training that you need to complete to safely dive the Explorer is a lot like the training that you took for open circuit scuba. There's class work, there's pool work, and there's work in open water. One way the Explorer differs from technical rebreathers that use multiple gases is that with the Explorer you use a single gas, nitrox, which makes it much simpler. All rebreathers are more complicated than open circuit scuba, but with the training, which is specific to the Explorer, you'll learn how to assemble the unit, how to check it to make sure it's functioning correctly, how to dive with it safely, and how to properly maintain it. The number one lesson you learn in Explorer training is when in doubt, bail out. Switch to your open circuit and make a safe ascent. So the Explorer is more complicated than open circuit scuba, but the advantages are that you can stay down for up to two hours. And because you're not releasing large clouds of bubbles, it's extremely quiet, you don't scare away the fish, and it just makes for a much more natural experience. I assumed that rebreathers would require me to change my whole style of diving, and I was kind of apprehensive about that, but that's not true. Underwater, the Explorer offers a style of breathing that's much more natural than open circuit diving. I've always felt that rebreathers were meant just for tech divers with years of training and experience, but after diving with the Explorer, I've learned that it's much more accessible than most divers would believe. I had some initial reservations about rebreather diving based on everything I had previously heard, but once I got my hands on the Explorer during the setup, I learned that this was much easier and more fun than I could have ever imagined. <laughs>